Hi everybody, thank you for watching. So here is my first CVS haul for this week. So there are some amazing deals. I did pick up quite a few of them. There's also some about a rebates that I did. So like always, I'll go over the breakdown of each of the deals, show you my receipt and let you know how much I paid. I did have a few hiccups. Um, there was one deal that I ended up having to return uh, because it didn't work out for me. But like always, I'll go over it. So the first deal that I did is a degree and it's degree and the dove. So it's the um, deodorant deal. So they buy one, get one 50% off. And when you spend $20, you get a $7 extra buck. So I picked up two of the women's. They are, well, all of them are $7.49 each, the men's and the women's. But what I did was always scan the items in the app because I have $4 of two coupons for these, but there is a $125 coupon a digital coupon that is attaching to just these ones here i did scan like the pink one and the green one and it wasn't attaching to those it was actually only attaching to these ones so i did pick those up hoping for the double dip to work and it did so basically the degree they are 7.49 each buy one get one 50 percent off so picking up four of them i only paid 22 dollars and 51 cents i had two of the photo of two manufactured coupons that we got in the last save the $1.25 digital did come off, so that was a glitch. I had a $5.15 CRT and then a $2 CRT. So I paid $6.26. I got the $7 back. Work out to be a $0.74 cent money maker for that one. Purely because of that digital coupon that did glitch. If that digital coupon did not come off, it would still be just under, I think about, what, $0.25 cents for all of those items, which is still an amazing deal. The next deal that I did is the St. Ives. So you can get St. Ives, you can get pods, you can get simple. So they're part of the same promotion. It is spend 15, get a $5 extra buck. I picked up the St. Ives. This is my husband's favorite. We we're actually running quite low. I think I only had about two or three bottles left in my stockpile. So I was thankful that I was able to pick up these three. So their normal price of $6.29 at my store. So three of them did come to $18.87. I still had some $1.50 coupons from the last save. They did expire, I think, on Saturday, but my store allowed expired coupons. So I used three of those. I also had a 4 for 12 CRT and then a $3 CRT. So I paid $7.37. I got the $5 back. Work out to be a cost of $2.37, which is still an amazing deal. Um, but that also is $18 tracking in beauty. So to pay $2.37 for three of them, I'll take that any day. One of them is $6.29. So um, I did pick those up. Uh, the next deal that I did, so I did kind of like a combined deal. So with the Jergens, they're on special buy one, get one 50% off. So I did pick up two of them. One is $8.49, the other one is $4.24. So for the two of them, it did come to $12.73. I did uh, pick up the Vaseline and the Beauty 360 in a combined deal because I had a 4 for 20 lotion CRT. The Vaseline is on, on its own deal where it's buy one, get 50% off, and when you spend 12, you get four. So now I have, um, this is 4 dollars so I have $5 basically tracking on that one. I don't think I'll finish that off, but this worked out to be a good deal for me overall. And then as a filler, I picked up this Beauty 360 lotion. It's their uh, version of the Vaseline. It was right next to that bottle. And they're on special buy one get one 40% off, but I just picked up that one for $2.59. So I did pick up all four of those. It did come to $20.31. I had a $1.50 coupon for the Jergens and then I used the $1.50 digital. I had a 5 of a 2 Jergens CRT. I had a $2 Vaseline CRT and then I had a 4 for 20 lotion CRT. In the end, I paid $6.31. There are $1 I bought a rebates for the Jergens. So after that, I paid $4.31 or $1.07 each, which is a really good deal for me. Also, that is $20 tracking for beauty. So if you want to incorporate beauty, that's basically paying $2.31 for each of them or just over 50 cents each. So that is an amazing deal because um, if you haven't noticed, we like a cocoa butter, but yeah, to pick all those up for 50 cents each, that is an amazing deal there. The next deal that I did is the L'Oreal. So it's unadvertised. 
in the ad it says uh ten dollars off when you buy one l'oreal serum there's also a unadvertised deal on the other l'oreal products so any other l'oreal products the age perfect and all that is spend 25 get five dollars back so what i did was i picked up one of these uh cell renewal age perfect rose tone moisturizers so they are $26.99 in my store so i did pick up one of those i still had a four dollar manufacturer coupon from a last insert it did expire but my store allowed expired coupon so i was able to utilize that and then i had three crts i had a six of a 24 a seven off of age perfect and then a five dollar of age perfect after that, I paid $4.99. I got the $5 back. We got to be a one set money maker, but that's also 26 tracking for beauty. So after beauty, that worked out to be free. So that that worked out for me. Um, do scan, always scan your products in the store. Um, a lot of people are getting like percent off coupons for L'Oreal. I just had those three CRTs and I was able to do that deal. And so I was really happy with that i did all of those on one transaction so i will go over my receipt so with this uh transaction so i actually picked up two clairol hair color so the clairol is on special two for 15 um and we have those buy one get one free coupons i was hoping that the digital coupon will double dip and come off with that um it did not so i ended up having to return it um but yeah you will see it on the receipt here so I do have the two Clairol here, but I did return those. There are my two Jergens. There is the Beauty 360 Cocoa Butter for $2.59. There are all the degrees for buy one get 50% off. There is a Vaseline for $4.99. There are the three St. Ives, and then there is a L'Oreal for $26.99. So I have two $4 coupons for the degree, three $1.50 coupons for the St. Ives, $1.50 for the Jergens, and $4 for the L'Oreal. That is the buy one get one free uh, Clairol coupon. Um, I will show you in the end what happened. So with the Jergens is the digital coupon. There is the 125 Dove and Degree digital coupon that did glitch and come off. And here are all my CRTs. My $7, my six, my five, my $5 off Jergen, my $5 off Degree. $4 off Hand and Body Lotion, the $4 off St. Ives, $3 off St. Ives, $2 off Vaseline, $2 off Clairol, $2 off Degree. And so I rolled $22 in extra bucks. I paid $7.90 and then I did get back the $5 for the L'Oreal. I got back $7 for the Degree and then I got back $5 for the St. Ives. So I spent a little bit out of pocket. And so what I did was I actually returned the Clairol. So the way it worked out with the Clairol, so I did do this quick breakdown. Um, so they're two for 15. I had that buy one get one free manufactured coupon and then $2 off uh, CRT. And so it cost me $5.02. I was not gonna pay $5 for hair color. I was actually hoping that that $5 of two digital would glitch and come off. So in the end, I got a refund. So what I did was they refunded me $2.49. So I do have that one there. And then they did, well, did print off a $3.96 extra buck there. So after returning that, I ended up making $1.16 which is not my intent. Um, I was just hoping to get it for free and then basically that would work towards beauty. But in the end, I did return that one there. So that was the hiccup that I did have with this trip. Um, but overall, I was still happy with what I ended up with. So the next deal that I did, I actually did a few razor deals. So the Gillette and the Venus, they're part of promotion of when you buy two, you get a $10 extra buck. So I did pick up uh, the cheaper Venus for $9.99 and then the men's Gillette for $10.99. I did not get the PNG in my area. I may get it today in my weekly um, grocery ads in the mail. So we'll see if I get a uh, insert, but there are digitals for this. So the way it worked out for the two of them, it did come to $20.98. I had two $3 digital coupons, $3 off the Gillette and then $3 off the Venus. I also had a 5 of 20 CRT on any shaving. So I paid $9.98. I got the $10 back. We well, got to be a two cent money maker for those two there. So I did make it work with a digital coupon. So I was really happy with that. The next deal that I did is the 
skin to mid deal so the chic deal so it is spend 25 get a 10 dollar extra buck so what i did was i picked up two of the skin to mid disposables they are nine dollars and 49 cents at my store so two of them came to 18 dollars and 80 cents and then i did pick up the two pack of edge they are 6.99 in my store so for the three of them it did come to 25 dollars and 79 cents I had a $4 printable coupon for the skin to mint. Um, they're no longer available, but mine doesn't expire until I think the 31st. And then the $4 digital did come off. And then I also had another 5 of 20. So I had two 5 of 20 CRTs on shave. So with this one, I paid $12.79. I got the $10 back. Also, there is a $1.50 I bought a rebate on the Edge um, for the Twin Pack. There is a $1 on the Singles, and then there's a $1.50 on the Twin Pack. So I did get that. We got to be cost of $1.29 for all those items there. The next deal that I did is the Neutrogena makeup so they are it's buy to get a six dollar extra buck so what i did was i picked up one of the mascaras at 10.99 and then i picked up one of these neutrogena makeup removal sticks at 10.99 so for the two of those it did come to 21 dollars and 98 cents i did this purely on digital coupons and crts so it came to 21 dollars and 98 cents there is a $2.50 digital coupon on any Neutrogena eye product, so that came off. There's also a $3 digital coupon on any Neutrogena, I think it's specifically on that makeup removal stick. So I did scan this in the store and that came off. I had the $4 instant coupon for the Neutrogena, um, I think that printed last week. And then I had two $3 off 10 CRTs. So one of them was specifically for the Neutrogena um, rem makeup removal and then the other ones for any cosmetic. So that came off. So I paid $6.48. I got the $6 back. We got to be a cost of only $0.48, cents, but that is 21 tracking in beauty there. So I did all of those on one transaction. So I did the two razor deals and the Neutrogena. So here you've got, there's the Edge, there's the two Skin Skintimate, there's the Venus and then the Gillette and then there's the two Neutrogena. So here you've got my $4 off the Chic, that's the paper coupon, and then everything else is digital. There's my other $4 Chic digital, my $3 off Neutrogena, my two $3 for the Gillette and the Venus, and then the $2.50 Neutrogena. So here are all of my CRTs, my two $5 off 20, and there's all of my CRTs for the Neutrogena. So with this one, I rolled $27 and a few 2%. I paid $2.18 and I did get back the $6 for the Neutrogena, I got back the $10 for the Chic and then $10 for the Gillette. And the last item that I did pick up is the March freebie item, the March beauty item for free. So this uh, CVS hand um, healthy hand lotion. It's normally $3.79. I scanned that in the store and my March Beauty gift did attach to that. So that came off. So I basically got that one for free. I ended up doing that one on its own transaction. So here you've got, um, there is, there's the product there and there's my free Beauty Club gift CRT that came off. So I paid zero for that one there. So that's everything that I got at CVS. So for all these items, it would have cost $161.22. That is the sale price. After coupons, I paid $54.18. And so I got back $43 in extra bucks. I got back $10 for the Skin Skintimate. I got back $7 for the Degree, $5 for the St. Ives, $6 for the Neutrogena, $10 for the Gillette and Venus, and then $5 for the L'Oreal. So I did get back $43 in extra bucks. I also got back $3.50 for my butter. So $2 for the Jergens there and then $1.50 for the Edge. So $3.50 back. Well, it got to be a cost of $7.68 for all these items. I do have $91 in beauty products here. So I did check the app before I went into the store and it said I already had 13 tracking um, with the Epic Beauty event. So you only need to spend another $60 to hit um, the maximum of $20 in beauty. So I did do that. So I should get, if you want to incorporate that, that is $6 back in beauty. So after
after that work out to be a cost of one dollar and 68 cents which is not bad um but also uh when i did return that claro i made a dollar 16 so if you want to include that into it basically i paid 50 cents for all these items which is amazing so from 161 dollars down to about 50 cents i would take it so um, there's a lot of deals that's happening at CVS. Uh, there's a few laundry deals, but like I said, I I don't have my PNG. Hopefully, it will come tonight, and then maybe I'll go back to CVS again later on and do a few other deals when I have those coupons. So yeah, here is my first CVS haul. Thank you for joining me. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah.